Hey guys and welcome back to World of Animals. So today another update and we will look on a small tank of myself. It holds about 6.6 .6 or 6.7 gallons. It used to be a um, breeding tank but I changed it. So let's have a look. So that is the tank. We have three stems of Hygrophila polysperma in here and the whole bottom is covered with plants. So basically this isn't a carpeting plant. Um, I bought some seeds online. I put them on the substrate and kept it wet and after two or three weeks I filled the tank up with water and um, the plants continued to, continue to grow. Um, this might be another um, species of Hygrophila, um, maybe it is the Araguaya, but I'm not sure. I'm really not sure what it is, but it grows pretty good, it looks awesome, and it's made for a shrimp tank, in my opinion. We have a small piece of spiderwood here, which um, is at the middle of the tank and right there that's some um, Christmas moss but it won't grow pretty well in here but we still have the carpet of plants another uh, some stem plants in the back and of course floating plants at the top and a sponge filter back there so in this tank we have only four shrimp at the moment and those shrimp are three snowball shrimp you can see one right here they are white and you can see through their bodies which is pretty cool and we have one tiger shrimp as well it's actually over here on the moss it's difficult to see but it's a nice guy as well I love him he's the most active of all the four shrimp in here hopefully I have got males and females of the snowball shrimp so they will breed but I think so but at the moment they are still pretty small so we have to wait and um, see them grow which is awesome as well. What I actually love about this tank is that the shrimp can hide if they want to all the time. They have plenty of possibilities to hide because of the carpet of plants and it will grow taller so they can swim around it and through the leaves, in between the leaves, sorry, and it's just awesome. I'm really excited about seeing this tank grow in the future and hopefully yeah the shrimp will reproduce in here but I'm pretty posi positive that th this will happen if there are females within those three snow shrimp snowball there are also some snails in here which help to keep the tank cleaner, eat of algae and we have some cyanobacteria around here. Um, I hate those, they're really annoying but they're not that bad and I can easily remove them from the carpet so it's okay. And the tank is well established by now so the inhabitants will do pretty well in here. So that's it for this video. Hopefully you like my shrimp tank here. I think it's one of my best tanks. I love it. And yeah, I will do updates in the future. If the shrimp grow and reproduce, of course, I will show you guys that. So. As always, leave a like and a comment and subscribe if you want to. We see us on the next video. Stay tuned.